at noon or 11 a.m. in old time. I'm still on old time. Maybe. I don't know. I don't even, I don't even think I go by time actually, but it's about noon and Max and I are awake. He has to work today at 4 p.m. so that means I'm going home. He has to work tomorrow as well, but I think he's got to work from 8 a.m. till like midnight or even past that because he's like in charge. Max was like overwhelmed by like the stuff his boss gave him because his boss is trusting him to do this stuff, but I think Max can do it. Max just went to the bank and I just got dressed and ready and maybe he and I will uh, hang out a bit before I have to go home. Max is just getting gas right now and he, he's taking me home right after this because he's got to go to work. But he, uh, he unfortunately needs to pay for gas, but the gas price went down a few cents. I won't see him until a few days from now. He's got to do a lot of work at the Opera House. Ever since I got home today, I have been on a crazy cleaning spree. I cleaned and vacuumed my room and for some reason Philip was interested in the vacuum and the noises and the things I was doing with it. He wasn't running away and that's odd for cats because usually cats hide in the very opposite corner of the house when a vacuum's on. And I cleaned my whole upstairs and the last thing that I've been dreading is my laundry. I've got a problem with laundry. Me, laundry, problem. I guess it wouldn't be such a problem if I didn't like let it build up for months because I just wear all my stuff and wear it and wear it and wear it and then when I finally don't have stuff I decide to uh, do it. But it is a lot of towels too. So I'm going to be finishing up my laundry and then just relaxing for the rest of the night because I clean my whole upstairs in my bedroom really well. Max is at work, he's the boss so he's kind of like big responsibility there. Philip's watching me do my laundry. He loves watching me throw the stuff around. I'm making piles. <laughs> He's having fun. He's always with me. What's in there, eh, Philip? He's a curious cat. Most cats are terrified of vacuums and washing machines. Oh, he's gonna find that it's gonna spin when he's standing on it. <laughs> It's like, why is it moving? Hey, Philip, are you checking out my washing machine? Hey, what's in there? Hey, are you curious? Load number one is now in the dryer. Load number two is now in the washer. Oh yeah, don't you love my cleaning hair? Cleaning here for the win. What are you doing? So I cleaned my whole room, vacuumed. Philip sat and watched while I vacuumed, but uh, like right after I was done vacuuming, I stepped on that tray and like it flew like all the way over there. So I had to like gather it all up. Kind of sucked right after I cleaned. But everything's good. I just have my clothes piled on my beds, but everything else, all the garbage is gone. Everything's good. Feels good. And this is where I'm going to be sitting tonight because I'm going to relax. And I'm going to play some PS3 all by myself because Max isn't off work yet. I'm trying Grand Theft Auto 4 again. I had all these games on my old PS3 and then once my old PS3 died, I didn't pick those games back up and I didn't beat them. Like, I almost beat Dragon Age and I almost beat... Grand Theft Auto and Little Big Planet. I did beat that, but I was I was working on collecting the rest of the the stickers and stuff, and that's a hard thing to do. And I almost had them all. I had like everything almost beaten, and then my PS3 just decided to do what everybody else's did and die. It was a 60 gigabyte though, and I got it a day after the launch, so of course it's gonna die. It conveniently died uh, around the time that the Slims came out. Same with Max's. Max's died twice though, and the first time he just had to pay for a refurbished one, which was crap, and that one died too. Installing data to hard disk drive. Back when I first played Grand Theft Auto 4, there was no trophies for it though. Same with Max. Max beat the whole thing, and then they introduced trophies for it. When you go load your game, it's like you have to start a whole new game fresh and not use any cheats if you want to get the trophies. I don't know any of the cheats, but I know cheats are popular for the Grand Theft Auto games because I have the ones for PS2 and I wouldn't beat the game, I would just use cheats and have fun and then just turn it off. But when I first got my PS2, a long ass time ago, I got uh, Tony Hawk 3 and Grand Theft Auto 3 with it and I didn't get memory cards with it. I guess 
it wasn't a known thing because like I never had a Sony product before. I was always with Nintendo. So like I had those two games for the longest time with no memory cards and then it was like $40 for a memory card. I was like, why can't I ever save? I always have to do this exact same stuff. And then when I turn it off, it's gone. 